Hope you guys like that. That's how I'm starting off my videos from now on with some straight fucking sex tease, bro. I don't give a fuck. You niggas wish you could have my fucking tongue. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, bro. You can tell the pre-workout has already kicked in. Oh, that cat almost got his shit fucking bipped. Oh my god. Dude, that cat just ran across my fucking path and almost got his shit fucking fucked by my car. Not me. I would never fuck a cat. That seems a little out there, even for me. And you know me. I'm fucking out there. Pause? I don't. Well, either way, I am. Even though it seems like a lot of it. I'm very, very fucking angry at myself right now. By the way, that wasn't English. I'm not even going to try and go back or address it. Um, I guess I just addressed it. Um, I'm very, very fucking angry at myself because I bought uh, my. I got a new Elgato and I got a new uh, Chatlink Pro so that I could use my headset while I play the game. And I couldn't figure out how to do the audio. I was messing with it, I was tweaking with it, trying to figure out which one was going to work the best. So, what did I do? I decided, hey, we're going to unplug it, plug it back in, didn't work. Restart it, didn't work. Plug it into the PC, didn't work. Plug it back into the Elgato, worked. I got so excited that I broke the fucking, I got so excited that I broke the fucking, uh, the, the male chip into my fucking controller. I broke it into my controller, bro. Inside of it. Had to buy a new, I have to buy a new fucking chat link pro, bro. Oh my God, my camera's falling and I'm about to break it. Ah! I'm sorry if you're a headphone user. I am just, I have no fucking words. For this stupid fucking camera to stay up, you fat fucking bitch ass slut. Bitch. Fucking bitch. Um, it's late, if you guys couldn't tell by it being, you know, dark outside. Uh, Ty, why are you going to the gym? I thought you go in the morning now. Guess what, nigga? I didn't fucking close today. I did a mid. So that means I have time to go to the gym at night, which is what I'm going to do, motherfucker. Also, Team USA had their first exhibition game against Canada today. Haven't seen anything. I saw. I watched about one minute of the game. The only thing I saw that I saw that was cool was uh, Joel Embiid made a layup. Made a layup. And that's not very cool because if you guys know me, you know I fucking hate Joel Embiid. But shout out America. Shout out Team USA. We're fucking everyone in the Olympics. I hope Dylan Brooks, bitch ass on Canada, got his shit plowed by somebody. I just really, I really, really hope. And best believe, I will be talking my shit this entire video to Mr. Brooks because that kid is one of the only men in America that I fucking hate. Shout out America. Uh, shout out Joe Biden. I also saw that my real president, Mr. Barack the Vote Obama, was uh, in attendance of the Team USA game today, which is you know, always cool to see uh, the real president, the best president, the GOAT, some may say at an event like that. Uh, two goats in one building, LeBron and Obama. What can I say, man? What the freak can I even say? What can I say? Also, Vince is hating on me calling it still the spring bulk, so from now on, I'm gonna probably put the title as something I talked about in the intro and then the bulk. Or I'll put the bulk, then in parentheses something I talked about in the title and the day. Uh, just, cause, just so I can make Vince's OCD fucking little fucking tight butt happy. <laughs> Sorry. I don't, know, I don't know if it's his butt, butt tight. I don't know. Don't quote me on that. I've never been in his butt, especially with all the sketch allegations. I don't want to be seen as one of those. Not like that. I don't, not that it's a bad thing. We love sketch. But uh, how, about, how about I just go do chest and then we'll talk later. Oh. Ah, man. That's a, that's a quick little prayer, guys. Yeah. Dear Father God, thank you so, so, so much for giving me the amazing chance, the opportunity to drive to the gym safely. I pray for a safe time here, most probably a safe time home for every single one of my friends and family members and anyone else who may be doing what I'm doing as well. Thank you for giving me the chance, the opportunity to do this thing that I love again. Without you, none of this would be possible. But because with you, everything is possible, Jesus. Thank you so much, Father God, for everything you gave me today, leading us to this point. I do not have a personal physical spot on me, so I ask you to come in and be my spotter. Okay. Help me to persevere, push past fear, 
bring the most out of me today. I'm gonna end this workout by myself. It's my favorite day of the week. Yet again, you know, chest day, baby. Because you, this is possible. Thank you for everything. Thank you for everything you've done, everything you will do, everything you've done for me, everything you've done for people around me. I'm sorry I took your pre workout. It's, uh, it's not everyday thing, God, but you know, this is the most important part of work right here. This is where I'm talking to you. So, you know, thank you, Lord. Thank you for everything. Amen. Set. Do not settle. Don't settle for anything. Don't settle for anyone. Don't settle for anything that is below the standard that you know you have for yourself and you know that others have for you. And there's a lot of people out there that are willing to drop below their standard just to stay happy or just to have comfort or safety. It's not worth it. Every single person out there has their own worth. Every person needs to recognize that worth and be able to, you know, expect from other people what they expect to be given. And if someone can't give you, especially if they can't give you just your bare minimum, you gotta go, man. Friends, family, relationships, anything like that. So, you know, just learn to let go of people that are not respecting you, your worth, and who you know you can be. Now, but I'm going to get the go, I promise. Fight but God Himself. No one has the ability to do anything to you that will hurt you more than yourself or than God can. So push yourself. All right. Make the most of every moment. Make the most of every opportunity. Make the most of every chance you get to be great. Because, you know, if you waste those opportunities, and you waste those chances, you lose out on an opportunity or a person or on whatever it is, you will regret it. You know what I say about regret? I would rather die than anything in my life. Incline cable flies, this beast, and the It's that bottom boy survivor, baby. But you guys really know what to say? I'm just gonna give you the first two lines.
there's spots in your life, but when you're in the places where you don't want to talk, where you're kind of negative in your own headspace, when you don't really know what to say to someone or something about a certain situation, I think those are the I'm pretty positive that those are situations and experiences where you're going to shape, start to shape your own future at least because it's going to be those moments that define who you're going to be, how you're going to be that person, and why you're going to become that person. You know, next time you're by doing too hot, look for comfort, look for someone that has your back, look for support from yourself, man. You don't have to have someone else support you if you feel that you have to ask yourself. Do your thing, uh, the way you say it. I kept on begging you to stay. I put it work to be with you, he ain't deserve it like me. That was young boy, but look what just came on. Look what just came on, look what just came on. Come on, man. Come on, man. My shit just don't miss. Mm -mm. I'm trying to hold a one. Seven figures when they text me. What do you say? Get this. Everybody's talking all the stuff about me. I don't need permission to make my own decisions. That's my prerogative. What do you say? They say I'm crazy. I really don't care. That's my prerogative. They say I'm messy. But I don't give a damn. Alright, come on, I gotta 
Sleeper pig, sleeper pig, sleeper pig. Airplane, shall be. Remember that, dude? What else? What else? Low picture, huh? Well, move the rest of the world. Let's go. Talk to me. Flies.
got the freaking exposure we want. Bro, why boy, why be just like makes me smile. Pause. What's in the song? I got people on. Alright, I'm gonna do some side dumps. Hmm. Do you guys wanna watch that today? Up to you. I rock paper scissors. You picked rock, right? You guys are coming with me to do some side belts. Alright, let's see if we can put these 45s for the lateral raises today. Let's see. Alright, let's see. Alright, let's see. Alright, let's see. from those week out from my last week I sit. Actually, let's go home and record a video. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Talk to him, bro. Talk to him, bro. Oh, wait. It's not even going to get away. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, what's up? What y'all know about this? What y'all know about this Hamilton, though? What y'all know about this Hamilton? See it. See it, yo. Who's a race? Me a letter every day.
a legacy to protect. Death doesn't discriminate between the sinners and the saints. It takes and it takes and it takes, and we can live in any way. We rise and we fall, and we break and we make mistakes. And if there's a reason I'm still alive, when everyone who loves me has died, I'm willing to wait for it. Wait for it. I'm willing to wait for it. What do you say, though? Hamilton doesn't hesitate, he exhibits no restraint, takes and he takes and he takes and he keeps winning anyway, changes the game, plays and he raises the stakes, and if there's a reason he seems to thrive and so few survive, then God damn it, I'm willing to wait for it. genuinely don't like Hamilton, if you don't sit there and, and watch it like at least once every fucking few months, you, if you don't know where to watch it, Disney Plus has it, um, but if you go watch it, seriously, oh my god, look what's next, wait, wait, stop, 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 seem, talk to him, I'm sorry, boy seems to like the girls who laugh at anything, the ones who get undressed, for the second day. Okay. Uh, didn't talk about a single important thing that entire ride home, just sang songs. But I will say, fantastic chest day, good shoulder portion. I didn't show you all the shoulder sets, I just showed you two. I did four, I think, maybe five. But great day. I'll see you guys tomorrow for it. Bye.